What up? What up? How y'all doing? Us too. That's right. You guys doing good as well? Doing great. We heard doing all right, great. All right. Hey, we're here with obviously Da Todd. Da Todd. And Miss Allie. Miss Allie. I'm Chris. That's Rob. Yep. Exactly <laughs> not. <laughs> Wait, but that's what? Rob. I'm Chris. So therefore, <laughs> we're what up with Rob and Chris. That is right. Yes. What just happened? <laughs> I don't know. We were having a moment there. Yeah. So, yeah, we're going to just talk about like some of the favorite things we did over the past yeah. month. It's kind of a fun little feature that we're kind of going to throw out there maybe yeah. once every couple of months or once every six years. Who knows? But yeah. Let's see how it goes and see how we like it. Yeah. All right. So I know I went to uh, Bishop's. Oh, nice. Oh. Yeah, I love Bishop's. And uh, kind of got cut short a little. Well, I had to go twice. But uh, so the first one got cut short because... Um, Chris had to run home real quick. Yeah. He had to go real quick. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> Squirrel. Uh, yeah. So, TIA. Then the <clears throat> early, and then um, went back and, you know, just had to get that caramel apple. Oh, yeah. Had to get the uh, apple cider. And what else did we get? Um, Fudge? No, you know, I got a pie with, with uh, that soft serve ice cream on it. Oh. Got a pumpkin pie. Now, they don't make, like, your pumpkin pies you buy at the grocery store and all that stuff. This was so fresh. It almost kind of had, like, that mealy type of yeah thing to it. Yeah. So it was a little different. I don't know if I was in love with it. The ice cream was good. But um, that was just, I love going up to Bishop's. Bishop's is so fun, and people are having a good time, and, you know, they make good food. We had good food when you were there. Yes, we did. Well, we had tri tips tri-tips sandwich tri-tips was Ooh. phenomenal. Oh, good. They made it was so, so phenomenal that it was <laughs> phenomenal, folks. <laughs> so I loved Bishop's um, right now. That was something I really loved. Um, even though I do it twice, it was it was worth it. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Um, oh, and the fudge there is incredible. Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, that's what I just said. The fudge. Yeah. 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 Oh, my gosh. They will let you taste you know, as I just kept asking for more tastings, yes. and they, she didn't stop. She kept like, yeah. sir. I'm like, I've had like just, uh, just a pound, pound, pound again, and all you can eat buffet. What do they do? Get out. <laughs> yeah, big mistake, right? Yeah. Anyways, would, would you have something really cool that you had? You know, you go, Todd. My favorite thing that I did this month mm-hmm. was I actually officiated my first wedding. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. So my uh, niece and now her husband, um, I actually got to. I got to marry them. I was the officiant. Yeah. So that was a cool lifetime memory. And uh, I got to dress fancy. I got to dance with my wife. And uh, we had a great experience. And it was a it was a lovely wedding. And that was my favorite experience of the month. Tell me, were you nervous like before it, like being your first time to do that? Was that a really nerve wracking thing? So I, um, <clears throat> I actually have no problem standing up in front of a crowd mm-hmm. and, and talking. So that hard was to believe. Weird. Yeah. 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 Weird. Oh, whoa. <clears throat> But what's really funny is it kind of like the beginning of the wedding just sort of like happened. Like all of a sudden it was happening and I stood up there and I realized we were doing um, a hand fasting ceremony. Like where you tie the hands together kind of thing. Like a very medieval tradition kind of thing. With the handcuffs? Like, with pink ones? <clears throat> no, no. It was, a, it was just a nice little band. Nothing <laughs> weird. Um, but I realized when I got up there, I started checking my pockets. And I'm like... I don't have the band in my pocket. Oh, um, yeah. so <laughs> a little nervous. Like, like as everything's starting, and my wife is sitting, you know, sort of towards the front. I'm like, I don't have the band. I don't have the band. <laughs> and so she runs to the, to the room and she gets the band, and then she hands it to the bridal party to my right, and it all gets passed down, and it <laughs> ends up in my hand. And I'm reading the ceremony as this is happening. I'm like, bloop, and this is what's going on, blah, 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 blah. And wow. Really? They had blah, blah, blah in the ceremony? Yes. Yeah. I'm impressed. I'm the really other impressed. thing that I did, and because um, I'm sort of a ham, is when they, I had hidden in my suit a giant pair of Halloween handcuffs, like ball and chain. Type. Oh, right. Yeah. Yes. So when it says, hey, do you have the rings? And they said... Yeah, and they start reaching for them. I'm like, well, I have some. And I pulled this giant handcuff out of the back of my suit. And I said, oh, you know what? We'll just use yours. And I tossed it off to the side. But it was, yeah, I got the audience going with that one. So So I got to do one once, which was really cool. And they were so nervous. They were holding hands. It was like white knuckles. 
Yes. Were they were they a couple that that nervous up there? Um. So I will be a little bit mean when I wrote the ceremony. I did lead them to several points where, like the expectation was, you say I do. Mm -hmm. But then I would stop them and be like, not yet, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> you were messing with them. Oh, I told, and that's why they wanted me because I did mess with them a little bit. Oh, I mean, I've known them since they were. I've known Jacob since he was in high school with Cassidy, and Cassidy, I've known her entire life. So it was it was fun to do that a little bit. It took a little bit of the nerves off when I messed with them. The crowd laughed, or they laughed, they were giggling. That's awesome. Um, Cassidy was very nervous, so you know, I'm like doing little things to keep her. From being nervous yeah. um but yeah it was it was a good time and um yeah i think it turned out really well i can't wait to see the nice players. yeah awesome. that's nice really i like cool. it i like yeah. it that's pretty cool before we move on leanie's pictures leanie leanie's pictures yeah definitely best photographer in the 916 that's right. check her out at, at leanie's pictures on instagram twitter and facebook we'd there love too. to see you and you'd love to see the pictures yeah so definitely check them out i like it I what's like your favorite of the month. My favorite of the month <laughs> is something super close to my heart, and that is you guys. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, yes. Awesome. Yes. Yeah. This so, poor girl. On the wall, 10 3. I couldn't say 3. 10 3. That's when I met them. Yeah. And we've just built such a great bond, and it's we always have. good it's really laughs great. and always a good time. <laughs> so, very fun. <laughs> Fun guys. I can't wait to see the outtakes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. And then we got uh, Larry Moe Curly here. <laughs> oh, my God. Is that not the truth? Well. <laughs> anyway. But, yeah, always such a good time. And they let me talk about something super important to me, which is my alopecia journey. Yes. And it's just great to spread awareness. And it's great to make a difference. And I'm really happy that. They're my supporters. Yeah. Aww. It's been so great to have you, too, because you. Yes. you bring such another voice to, you know, three crazy guys, but you bring just such another view that, that we really needed here. Thank yes, you. I agree. She does. She absolutely brings another view, which is the positive view. I'm like, yes. <laughs> wow. She's terrible. Super jaded. Yeah. Yes. So I, I I'm sorry, was that my outside Thank voice you. again? Yeah, I think we've been very lucky. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. thank you. Absolutely. So thank it's you. definitely changed us yeah. in the show. So, absolutely. I love you, woman. I love you. <laughs> uh, she's so sweet. I don't Mr. Care uh, says. Anchor by Spotify. So, it's kind of really hard to say what my favorite thing was this month. You know, I can't say that I've had a tremendous amount of things that were fun. But some things that were kind of interesting to me was, um, I would have to say would be going to Brewfest. Oh, cool. Um, super producer and I went to Brewfest. And, and that is out, so you can yeah, watch it. Yeah, it is. And the South Plastered Rotary Club does a great job on promoting this. And they give back to the community and scholarships for Whitney High School, um, Victory High School, and uh, Rockland High School, right? I said yep. the three, yeah. Yep. So they are based out of Rockland. So that's what I thought was pretty cool. Mm. And not only that, I got to see some people I hadn't seen in quite a long time. We chatted with them quite a bit. That's cool. Um, Ken Hubert, who is on the board, if I remember correctly, I can't remember his title, so excuse me. We actually had a great interview with him. He gave us a good four or five minutes and get the opportunity to check it out. I mean, yeah. to me, that was probably one of the funnest things that I had the opportunity to do other than my, you know, thing that I went sideways on. But other than that, we won't go there. You know, having this show, we've been able to do a lot of really cool things. Yes, we have. Um, from... Gosh, what was it? Sinister Con? Yes. Oh my right. God. We got to do that. We've done um, the fair. So we yep. want to thank the, the grounds. Yes, at the grounds. Thank you. Has so really much. allowed us to be a part of Rib, rib Cook Off, which was oh. so much fun to Oh be my at. God. That was so. Oh. oh my gosh. Such a great time. Uh, we They let us, we actually did. We just commandeered the. the, the Belts. The belts and just we just around them. and said, ah, what would it be like to get these belts? Yeah, you may not win. You may win. You are just teasing people. The whole Suckers. Way but it was cool to watch everybody do different things on that. Um, so there's a lot of cool things by uh, us being able to do things here. Yeah, definitely. Um, and I think what's also pretty cool for you and I, I think, is the addition of two wonderful people absolutely. to our panel shows. Yeah. I mean, she counts us two, right? 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, we're just talking about Alec. But, you know, I think that bringing them in and kind of doing this panel is kind of fun. Um, it's a little different. We've taken away from our live show and we went to this because we thought this would be a lot more fun. So... It, it has been. You know, from Rob and I, I want to say thank you guys for joining us. Yeah, and absolutely. Yeah. Well, thank you for having us. Thank yeah. you so much. And I'd also like to thank one of our sponsors. Yes. yes. Anchor by Spotify. Thank uh, you. Good yes. answer. Good yes. answer, yes. Alex. Yes. Good answer. Yes. Uh, so for all your listening needs, you can get us on the podcast. You can get yes. us on... Chris, go over all the... You've got them down. He's got them down. Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Stitcher, Spotify... Overcast, Castbox, Casba, that too. No, <laughs> I heart radio. Oh, Verbal, Verbal's a new one by the way. Yeah. That we're on Pandora. It's all underneath, right? Yes, yeah. it's down below. We actually got to get Verbal we're, up there. We got to get all that thing going on there. We have numerous, numerous people. That's been great to watch how we do this vlog, and then on top of that, we have you know the actual podcast, which yeah. has been such a, a, a nice growth. Absolutely, see where it's going right now. Absolutely. Um, and then our show has even taken another angle. We've actually included and brought in 65 Sports. Yeah, 65 Sports, which I think is going to be phenomenal. If you um, check out the latest edition, we're calling it the 65 Sports Series. We may change the name, but yeah. I thought it was kind of cool. Interesting take on So we brought it in uh, to our channel, and it's purely the 65. And, and um, our last one was, was Nathan Kent from Rockland High School. Yeah. And a, a Stud, by the way, just, just in case you guys wanted to know. Incredible man. young man. And a Rockland High School, and he's a chief in the U.S. Navy uh, Sea Cadets. Yeah. <clears throat> and he's a track and field runner who's broken three records, I believe, in his Rockland High now, and he's junior nationals track guy. So kid's wow. amazing. And yes. that, his show was just happened, started t- like today. or Yeah, a couple hours ago. And it's doing very well. Yeah. So we're really excited about that. And then we just interviewed a, an amazing 15-year-old kid at 12 Bridges mm-hmm. who's about six foot six, quarterback, fifteen years old. They only have JV right now. He looks like Trevor Lawrence. It's crazy. And, you know, he's somebody to watch, and you know he's really young, and and um, he's going to learn and grow and, and mature. And it's just really excited to watch him. So we get to bring that to you. And then Monday, we're actually interviewing Harper Peterson <clears throat> for the sixty five Sports, and she right now is currently the thirteenth ranked sophomore girls basketball player in the nation. Oh wow, that's amazing. That's awesome. So. Yeah. It's exactly. interesting how we've gone and changed what we've done from where we began. Wonder if her and Mary Carter know each other. They do. No, oh, that's cool. Yeah. So we've nice. had Mary Carter on before, yeah. and so we're really growing in that aspect and in changing up different things for everybody to watch. Yeah. And so it's been so fun to to change to do that panel yeah. shows. We're still going out to events. We're going. And we're still doing musicians, talking to musicians. Talking to musicians. We've got and quite a few more interviews with musicians that are going to be coming out. Musicians. So that too, cool. yeah. Yeah. You know, hey, said don't have a stroke. Times. <laughs> <laughs> uh, squirrel. Anyway. <laughs> so, if you guys had any other really cool things happening this month, I mean, we just got weather that came in, but before that, we we could still. We had sports going on, football games are happening. <laughs> yes, the Dodgers lost. The Dodgers <laughs> just lost. It lost a while ago since this is yeah. is airing, but um, so by this time the World Series is probably running. Nope, you know, might even be over by now. Yeah, so we can't tell you who won because we don't know. <laughs> yeah, but it's probably going to be the Braves. You think it'll be the Braves? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I love Dusty. He's a local hero around here, but I I just think the Braves are on a roll right now. It's a strong one, and I, yeah. I hope I'm wrong in a way because I love Dusty, but. It'll be fun for us to go watch this, you know, know, know that we didn't know, but this will come out after yeah. that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, so that's really cool. There's a lot of stuff in football happening. We're in the middle of the football seasons for for the, um, the high schools. Yep. So by the time this probably airs, we're probably talking playoffs, if not championships for high school. Right. And then basketball season's happening and soccer yes. season's happening and wrestling. Um, I'm just happy that sports are happening. Oh my gosh, yes, yes. okay. Yes, Bro. that's right. That's the greatest thing. So, so, what is your favorite sport? To watch or to play? All the above. Mm, my favorite sport to watch is basketball. I think it's cool. It's Okay, let me be honest. It's the most easy to keep up with. Like, football, it's like... There's a tackle, there's all these different sayings that I don't know. But, like, basketball, it's like, okay, they made a basket. Like, yay! Like, it's, it's, yeah. 
But um, I used to cheer, so anything like gymnastics, which maybe people don't consider it a sport, but I still think it's a sport. Gymnastics is a sport? Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 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 And cheer. 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 cheer is a sport. Cheer. Yes. Cheer is a sport. Yeah, okay. it is. Thank you. Yeah. Love to hear it. Yes. So, Absolutely. You know what would make cheer and gymnastics better? What? Tackling. I agree. I totally agree. Just guys hanging on the rings and some guy just comes up and says, I like it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, no. Who is that one guy, office linebacker, Terry Crew or something, you know? <laughs> Terry Tate. Terry Tate. <laughs> office linebacker. <laughs> anyway, you know, we got to wrap this up, guys. Yeah. Um, so, hey, you know what? Just, we'd love for you to share some of the things that you loved. Uh, yes, just the past, just... Share what what's go what you've gone out and done because it's yeah. so. This is what we're kind of brought this up is we're out doing stuff again. Yes, yes. As a world, as a community, and stuff, and like we just want to bring the fact that we're out doing stuff. I think that was yeah. really the point. Definitely. What have you done? What like, is your favorite thing? Yes. Right. Comment, Comment down, below. down below. Let us know. Is yes. there something coming up that's really cool that we should check out? Yeah. Because we want to go. Yeah. We want to do that. That would be great. Absolutely. Um, I'm, I know we're going to probably check out some Christmas lights. Yes. And, yep. Yep. And all sorts of fun stuff coming into the holidays right now. You know now. what I'd like to know from these folks? Mm. In the new year, I mean, I know we're a little <laughs> ways away from mm -hmm. New Year's resolutions, but think about it and let us know what you guys want to do in the next year in 2022. That's good. Mm. Mm. Yeah. And when you do resolutions, like, have you ever had one that's stuck? Like, lasted more than like a week or a month or an hour. Well, I'll give a great yeah. example. I quit Facebook for a whole year wow. and it stuck. It was amazing. That's I'm impressive. probably going to do it again because it was so good. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, you can't. I, I, sorry. I did it. I did a whole year. Yeah, awesome. I, I yeah. use them to advertise. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's why I have a backdoor for business stuff, but <laughs> the personal stuff. <laughs> that doesn't count, <laughs> Richard. <laughs> anyway. Anyway, so hey. yeah, let us know. Hey, we're just, we're happy to be here. We're having a great time. I hope you yeah. guys are enjoying as well. Um, maybe if we could finally figure it out, we may end up going to a live again in a panel situation. We're yes. getting closer in technology to get better at those things. Um, so hopefully we can bring a live back. That would be really fun. Yeah. Really yeah. Yeah. And maybe a guest. Ooh. Ooh. Just a little hint. We're working on our favorite travel agent. Yes. Jill. Enchanted Escapades. Yeah. So By she's Jill. our... Our in-house travel guru. guru. Yes. She literally has gone every other week. Yeah. Uh, she's here for an hour and, and then she, leaves. Yeah. So she was in Cancun and, then, and went straight from Cancun to Disney World. So that seems awful. I don't know how you're surviving. I you know. Uh, Jill, are you okay out there? Do you need us to help you? Yeah. yeah. Jill, comment below where you don't want to go. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. What up? We'll see you next time. What up? Have a great day and a better tomorrow.